March 8, our musical minute of minutia. I know this band can be divisive. You either love them or hate them, probably. But they sure loved a founding member who was born on this day in 1946 because he gave the Eagles their first million-selling single, Take It to the Limit, from this album. It's Randy Meisner. It's impossible, obviously, to hit all his high notes, pun intended, in 60 seconds. He left his home in Nebraska for L.A. in 1966, and he lived hand-to-mouth for years. Joined Poco in 1968, and he appears on their first album, but he quit the band before it was even released. He joined Rick Nelson's Stone Canyon Band in 1969, but then he just gave up, moved home to Nebraska in 1970, and worked for a John Deere dealership. Second trip to California changed his life as he became a founding member of the Eagles. But eventually, rock star life just became too much. He quit the band, kept making music for several years, even reunited with Poco for their legacy album. But his last known public performance was in 2008. Wishing Randy a very happy day on this, his 77th birthday.